All right, let's win this freaking face off. The way you win, you get Holy those damn. faces from all those going no, R, what? and you'll still have two or three gaps in your face repertoire. So what you have to do? Let's go another round. Haven't had enough yet, doll face. Is you just challenge him over and over again until he fills in all Ready? the gaps by showing off first. the faces. He always goes first. And you might have Here to re-challenge a few times because sometimes they use ones you've already got several times in a row. Bugged out, lazy eyed, Gomer. Bugged what? out, lazy eyed, do a face Gomer. Yet? I just see general disfigurement. Now check this out. Yeah. All right. So he did the bugged out, lazy eyed, Gomer. So we'll counter. Here comes the Arr! hooded, tweaking monkey. We're through the first round. We Max. are. But can you top this? He's got the Arr! nasty, cross-eyed geezer. <laughs> oh, is this a sound. pilgrim face competition? I could have sworn you said pirate. That. Let me show you. Nasty cross-eyed geezer, stinky, fish-eyed, meanie. Yeah. He's got the Arr. stinky, fish-eyed, meanie. Ha. Well, I'll be. I've given you all the faces that I know. Unbelievable. Threepwood has beaten the high prince of the puss. Bravo. Now is the ombudsman of unoriginality. Unoriginal? Me? <laughs> if you say so, short stack. I beat you. Now I demand your vote. Is that so? Oh, I almost forgot. Forgot what? Didn't you just I've declare had you had no more faces? Laying around. I think you cheated, but hey. Low holes to Betsy. Could it be? Holy buckets! I'm really hoping he has a glass eye. Ugh. Rarely seen, bros and bras. If the challenger can't top that, this competition is over. Are you suggesting that I pull out both of my eyes? Well, extreme. Yeah. He clearly broke the rules. Which rule is that? The spanking well, gesture. There ought to be a rule concerning the use of the freaky eye. I put up a fight. Can't you just give me your vote? I stated my terms. Can we refrain yeah. from using the riding spanking gesture on my uh, on my family-friendly channel? I had no chance the entire time, huh? Took you long enough to figure out. Your vote, or you're a dead man. Resorting to petty threats? Good luck. Oh, I don't have time for this. I'm sick of your runaround. I'm sick of your silly faces, and I'm sick of... Whoa. Maybe you're just sick, brah. <laughs> time to make this plague work for you, us. You yelly belly deserter! I've crushed the souls of men ten times as tough as you, and forgotten them by lunch. You'll do as I say, or rue the name Threepwood for the rest of your very short life! Dang! <laughs> we broke Moose! <laughs> Whoa! It's the ferocious, uh, green demon face? Threepwood wins! With the nastiest mug this side of the hypothalamus! Da -da 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 Fine! He wins! My vote is yours, but I've got my eye on you. All right, let's get the other nice. two votes. Let's get some votes. First of all, we got this clogged protuberance. Well, you know what? Acid's opened up every other clog, every other problem we've had lately. Much better. Well, better anyway. Blork. An Iron Maiden monkey. Huh, look at that. Somebody should really return this to their local library. Modern torture made easy. Yeah, I really hate to break a sweat while breaking the wills of my enemies. Yep. You can't even look at it, all you do is... Easy. Look there you go. Alright. We've gone through an odd protuberance again. Well. Alright. Let's get Noogie's vote, shall we? Ugh, Noogie. What kind of a name is Noogie, anyway? Hey Mo, what is it? Hey Mo, whoop 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 whoop. 
You know, you can't just go through life cutting throats and de handitating people. Oh, yeah? Yeah? Watch me. It's not really the best time for this, but uh, how about that guy over there? Pretty cute, huh? Four eyes? Kinda portly if you ask me. Come on, you should go on a little manatee date with him. No way. I feigned enough romance for one day. Well, what about... Did I say date? <laughs> I meant reconnaissance mission. He's dangerous. My guess? Assassin. Really? Yeah, really. Oh, really? Here's the play. I'm not buying Six. it either, and I'm you, Guybrush. Three brush. phase operation. First, you should... Hmm... Let's see, what should we do? Interrogate him. Ask him about himself. Let's figure out where this low life is from. Okay. Second, you must... Take his hand. Test his grip. In case it comes to fisticuffs. Okay. Lastly... Check for weapons. Give him a pat down. When things turn to duck soup, we need to know what we're facing. Okay. Okay, so... Interrogate. Test his grip. And then... Check for, check weapons. for weapons. Yep. You got it. Good luck. I've got your six. Thanks. Hey, Noogie. How was the date? At first, I was really uh -oh. nervous. Yeah? But it turned out good. Yay! She was so Even into Even though he's me. spotty. First, she wanted to know all about me. She was interested right off the bat. Nice. Then, she made the first move and took my hand. I knew I was doing well. Second base. Mr. Big Stuff over here. And then before I knew it, she's got her hands all over me. It was awesome. The perfect date. Good to know. Glad to hear it went well. So I've got your vote. Certainly. Oh man, I'm putting all of this in my journal. I even found a strand of a hair on my vest. That's going in too, as a keepsake. Get thing creepy. <laughs> uh, sorry. All right. We gotta have a unanimous vote. And while it would be fun to watch us fail, let's go ahead and cover all our bases. Let's take the torture book and the new member's manual. With a little elbow grease, I can swap the covers on these two books. And swap the covers, because Murray will turn on us and not let us in unless we give him some incentive. Uh, Murray, <coughs> I mean Santino, do you want to have a look at this new member's manual to the Brotherhood? You might find it pretty interesting. Reading is for the feeble. Oh, I just thought these initiation rituals might strike your fancy. The first step in drawing and quartering your victim is... Wait, wait. <laughs> what was that? Just going over some of what I can look forward to when I'm voted into the Brotherhood. Let me see that. You can just show them the torture manual, too, and that'll work <laughs> up to a point. Why, that's positively malevolent. Look at all the blood. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to Neither it. Neither am I. Wait a minute. Let me see the cover. Ha! It's the genuine article. Too bad I can't have your vote. Aha! You should be careful what you ask for. Consider my vote yours, and your demise imminent! Alright, I think that's everybody. Let's call for a vote. But first I'm going to pause the recording so I don't flub up again. Alright! Let's call for that vote, buddy boy! Boy there! Now what? Alright, call a vote. I feel good about my chances. Very well. Gentlemen, Goldilocks here would like to join the Brotherhood. Sweet. Voting time. My favorite. Calls for a drink. Brother Noogie, concerning the initiation of one Guy Brush Threepwood, what say you? Um, yes. I vote yes. I think he'll help raise... morale. Doubtful. Brother Moose, what say you? I gotta go with my boy Santino on this one. Yes! 
Roll out the red carpet and let it run with the blood of Threepwood's torment. Ready to rack. Oil up the thumbscrews. <laughs> Man, you're something else, Santina. I say, yeah. Nobody I is reacting to the protect. talking skull. Nobody's ah, freaking out. Fine. I vote no. What? You said if I'd beat you in a pirate face-off, I'd be in like Flynn. Yeah, man. I think you gotta keep your end of the bargain on this one. Oh, all right. But only to maintain the integrity of the Brotherhood. Bureaucratic ethics win again. You have a unanimous vote and a formal invitation to join the Guy democratically Brush. united what did I say about that gesture? of the interior. I accept. Do I get a sash? Or a button? No. Welcome, brother. Welcome. Burn in flame! You guys should really have buttons. I think they'd be a hit. What you do receive is the honor of one of the Brotherhood's greatest responsibilities. As the most junior member, you'll be the caretaker of the cochlea. It's the key to our permanent vacay. You're just giving it to me? Guard it with your life, brother. Well, that was easy. Hmm. Well, looks like we've beaten it. We've got the cochlea. That's all we needed. We have saved the world. Alright. Blork. Blork! Let's get out of here. One cochlea procured. Uh-huh. We'll be out of here in two shakes of a pirate's booty. Alright. Well, sure, Winslow. What's up? How you doing, Winslow? Can I get you anything? Can I call Welcome you Carl Winslow? I am well, thank you. I wanted to inform you, and I was crawling back under the covers. I came across something uh, unsettling. Not another outbreak of Polynesian bed mites. Oh, no, 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 no. And I've seen my fair share of disturbing things between the sheets, sir. No details. Uh, what was it, Winslow? I believe a threat, sir. I left it over on the gangplank. It came with a note. Something about this being what happens to those who try to interfere with the Brotherhood. Oh, Sea biscuit. Mmm, I love these things. Oh, guy rushed. And a seahorse head. Well, seems like uh, these guys are really dire serious, and uh, they mean they mean business. And I should never ever take this here cochlea I got right here in my inventory, climb up this pole, climb up this mast into this area, and uh, place it thusly as so. It's something I should never do. There you go, pal. Whoa! I think we're back on course. I think I fixed your manatee problem. How about that? I felt the beast rumble and checked my compass. It says that we're right on course. Ancient manatee mating grounds? Here we come! How did you fix his sense of direction? Funny you should ask. I ran into your old crew My and... crew? Yeah, and they had the cochlea the entire time. I just pretended I wanted to join their stupid club uh -oh. and... My crew! Yeah, your crew. Alive this entire time. Who would have thought? You betrayed us! Uh... I would never! We trusted you! Unbelievable, man. Uh, look, guys, I can explain. There's no need. Ah, Bug Eye, the unlikely voice of reason. Breaking the trust of the Brotherhood has only one consequence. Yeah, remember I told you the guy from uh, Psychonauts helped make the, this game? A double fine? A uh, double what? fine. You know, like some doubloons, but double the regular amount. But how do we determine the standard fine? Well, I'm not sure. Well, I suppose that's up to your discretion. Wouldn't it be less confusing to just settle on a larger upfront? That's enough! The only punishment is death. Kill him. Hey-oh! 